Yesterday, I tried connecting my laptop to my TV using an HDMI cable, but I was unable to get the screen to duplicate or extend. My TV was just black, and I knew the cable wasn't broken because I've used it on another computer before. So if I went into Device Manager, under Display Adapters, I had an entry that said Microsoft Basic Display Adapter, and it had a little yellow exclamation mark. And so if I right click on that and I click on update driver software, I can search automatically for updated driver software. But in my case, Windows was telling me that the most up-to-date version was installed already. But it wasn't solving my problem and I had a little error message next to it. And so basically what we need to do is install the proper driver for our graphics card. Now, I didn't know what graphics card I had in my laptop, so I had to find that out. If you're not sure what kind of graphics card you have, go ahead and click on this link here. This is a video I made that will show you how to find what kind of graphics card you have in your laptop or your desktop computer. So I knew that I had an NVIDIA graphics card, so all I had to do was go to the NVIDIA website and search for a driver for my graphics card for Windows 8. Now there wasn't one for Windows 8, but there was one for Windows 7, and I don't recommend using Windows 7 drivers for Windows 8, but it works so many times, including this one. So go ahead and try that. It might work. It worked for me. So I'm going to link to all the major graphic card manufacturers in this video description so you can easily get to their website and search for the correct driver for your laptop or your desktop. Once you find the correct driver, go ahead and install the driver. Here's an example of uh, the driver that I had to install. I just basically double clicked on that, ran it, it automatically installed it and updated my computer. I had to restart my computer, but you can see now under display adapters, I don't have an error message, I don't have a yellow exclamation point it has a driver installed for my graphics card not just the Windows basic display adapter and now when I connect my computer my laptop to my television I can just duplicate the screens I can extend the display and it works fine so I hope this video points you in the right direction the goal of this whole video was to share my experience with you and hopefully give you some insight on what you need to do to get your computer working properly so that you can watch whatever you're trying to watch on your television. So thanks so much for watching. Leave me a comment. Let me know whether it worked or if it didn't work. Uh, that can really help with uh, troubleshooting your issue. So that's it. Thanks so much for watching and good luck.